And so, Hugh, please can you tell us a bit about the cam your campaign for this election? Well, being a, a, a late arrival as a candidate and having rather limited personal time to, to give to it, I've concentrated very much on the social media side of things and, and the hustings, which I've enjoyed very much. Um, they, they, together with the large numbers of emails that one gets as a candidate, which I've replied to quite carefully, um, means I've been able to, to contact a decent number of people um, despite not, in, not having the time to do um, any significant amount of doorstepping. That's interesting. And is there any one particular experience from that that stands out over the last over the campaign? Well, I suppose as the campaign has progressed, and bear in mind I'm a beginner at this, um, I've probably got rather better at it. Um, so the last one was probably the most enjoyable. But it happened to be at the new Islamic Centre in London Road, um, where they made me extremely welcome. Um, and I was able to get some of my ideas across without being as tongue-tied as I usually am. Um, and that was followed by a, a tour of their new facilities and the prayer room and that sort of thing, which was quite a privilege to be able to, to see. So I suppose that one sticks in my mind as being particularly enjoyable. But as I say, I've enjoyed the hustings a lot. And I've had some very good email and social media um, responses as well. And we've actually picked up um, new party members and things um, through that uh, during the campaign. Oh, that's good to hear. Yeah, that's mm. interesting. And uh, this evening, how, I mean, how do you think this evening is going to go? I don't think we're going to do terribly well. Um, when we started two months ago, we didn't think we were going to do terribly well. And so I suppose you could just say that we were right. It would have been nice to think we were turning a corner. And I think perhaps we're not really there yet. Um, which is a shame because I still think that the Liberal Democrat Party embodies some really important human values. And uh, I would like to see them being better represented. And what do you think the future the Liberal Democrat Party has in store in terms of the future? I think we'll know a little better later on tonight. Okay.